I'm going to be honest about this. When it comes to debates, I myself, I'm a skeptic. My experiences with debates, I've always seen the two sides almost like in a shouting match. And it gets very personal and it's quite insulting in some ways. So I'm interested to know, um, how can debates be used as a positive thing to help interfaith dialogue as such? Um, it goes without saying that um, um, a normal debate shouldn't be uh, the way that you describe it. Um, um, people have to sort of put forward their reasoning uh, and argue with, at least debate with one another without uh, it turning into a shouting match, as you, as you put it. Um, and when we see the example set uh, uh, by uh, the Prophet, the Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and uh, how he uh, conducted uh, mm, his debates with uh, other people, um, uh, whether Jews, Christians, atheists of the time, um, we see that uh, it was uh, very amicable, uh, it was respectful, and um, we see that even whether it was the, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi or uh, the other Imams from Ahlul Bayt Alayhi uh, even if the other party were to uh, uh, insult them mm -hmm. or use derogatory terms against them, they wouldn't respond likewise. Yeah. Um, they would make sure that uh, um, they keep the environment, the atmosphere calm and uh, they try to resort only to, and uh, they try to use reasoning to refute their, the argument of the other side mm -hmm. um, without resorting to any of those conducts um, that uh, the other party may have mm -hmm. used.